this was almost good. This time I would like to show you how I made these shot glasses. To turn a piece of wood into a drinking vessel, obviously one needs to mill out the center bits, but as you might have seen in my previous video about me making a pipe, last time I tried to do something similar, it did not end well. So what I have done differently this time was, uh, instead of only narrowing down the very end of the workpiece, I made two steps on it, obviously one bigger and one smaller. The smaller bit went inside the chuck and the bigger bit got caught on the jaws. So I am not, not sure if I am explaining this clear enough, so I am just going to put some pictures in here so you can see what I am talking about. So yeah, this is the cutoff and it went into that chuck. After this, I started to drill out the center and when I finished drilling, I started to mill it out. This new to me way of uh, fitting the workpiece into the chuck worked miracles. Um, I actually was able to do what I wanted to do. Also, I made better choices on the tools. So this time there were no flying woods and, and stuff like that. <laughs> um, I, I still need to work on my skills because the, the bottom bits didn't turn out that good. After finishing the center, I started to work on the outsides and uh, basically decorating it. I used the exact same method to support this as I used when, when I was making the stem for my pipe. So I put an intermediate piece between the tail stack and the work piece. As you have seen uh, in the initial picture for this video, I made two of these glasses. The plan is to make a set of four, but right now I, I can't really do any work on that because in less than a week I will be traveling to Europe and uh, I need to, need to do all my preparations like cleaning the van and do all the last minute repairs. So I hopefully, fingers crossed, I will not break down on the on the road. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm a bit sparing this right now. I really want to get this video out before I go, because I, I will have no proper internet and I, I will not be able to upload it. Um, but other than that, yeah, I, I'm mainly occupied with preparing for, for my travels and I do want to do uh, woodworking there as well a lot. So hopefully there will be a lot of footage and maybe some decent videos will be coming. Back to the point, I sent it down the outsides and when it was smooth enough, I was ready to cut it off. Then took a piece of sandpaper to get rid of the sew marks on the bottom and I also started to sand down the rim. And then very cleverly I blew all the dust into my own eyes just like Homer on my shirt. And then it was finally the weekend and I managed to meet up with a couple of friends. So we decided to do some product testing because that is very, very important. But as I only have managed to make two of the glasses, we had to use that uh, car pig thing, cute animal, whatever. So the toast is a gashere kwe. A gashere kwe. A gashere kwe. Oh, in one! It's got a lot of language. Like a gashere kwe. It means uh, cheers. Or good habits. A gashere kwe. A gashere kwe. A gashere kwe. Cheers. Cheers. This was the amazing story of my first two short glasses. Thank you very much for watching.